All right, now the last part of this video program is actually that I'm going to show you how to find the right tags for your YouTube videos, which is also very important. Now the tags are actually nothing more than just keywords. And when you have related tags for your video, it's easier for YouTube to find your, or basically to show your video to the right people. And also it's very much easier for people on YouTube to find your video you try to rank for, okay? So let me give you an example. Let's say uh, my video is all about how to lose belly fat, okay? So I go to a website called taxyoutube.com. And by the way, I've put the link for this website in the bonus section in the resources file for you. So don't worry about this. And so I'm going to just put in the keyword right here in here. Okay. How to lose belly fat. Okay. Then I'm going to click get tax. It takes a while to load here on the left side. Now, as you can see, we could pretty much select all of them, but I would suggest you to just pick the ones, the long tail keywords, the long tail tags for your videos. Okay, I'm, I'm going to make a new search, how to lose belly fat. And then I'm going to just pick the ones that I think would be ideal. Okay, this could be this one, this one, this one, this one. Okay, so we have a couple of them. Long tail keywords, maybe this one. This one, this one. Okay, so the longer the better. This one. So I think you get the idea though, tons and tons of keywords that show up here and you just have to go through the list. Now you are limited to a certain amount of keywords, uh, sorry, not keywords, but um, letters in your tax section. So you cannot just use all of these, but you know, just play around with it a little bit. And it's really important to keep just one thing in mind. You always want to use long tail keywords. So something like this, how to get rid of belly fat fast, how to lose stomach fat, how to lose stubborn lower belly fat, how to get rid of love handles. Okay. So this is obviously not ideal. What else? How to lose stubborn belly fat. Okay. So you get the idea with this. You could, you know, put in any kind of keyword you try to rank for your main keyword, ideally, and then see what kind of tags show up for that specific keyword and use them for your video tag section. Okay. So that's pretty much all there is to it. And um, yeah, I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching. And I speak to you in the next video again. Bye.